Hi, I'm Charlie Jameson. I'm a board certified marital and family lawyer. The question is, who gets the engagement ring? Now, engagement is a major event in anyone's life. In fact, if we listen to the diamond industry, they tell us it's such a major event that we have to devote two months of our salaries as men to purchase this significant gift for our soon-to-be spouse. But the question becomes is whether you're a four dollar an hour person or a four million dollar an hour person, that's a significant amount of money. So if your marriage fails, the question is who gets the ring? Well, most women and frankly the majority of men would say, well of course the wife gets the ring, I gave it to her. Or she says, he gave it to me. Once again, under the law, it's not the answer that counts, it's the question that's more important. And believe me, that used to drive me crazy in law school, just like it probably drives you crazy to hear it right now. But it is true. Florida is an equitable distribution state. That means that anything purchased from the date you were married until the date you filed a divorce petition, or a date that you two agree upon, and good luck getting that, is considered to be marital property and the court gets to divide that between the two spouses. So the question really becomes is when was the engagement ring given to the wife? And that's, be and that's important in Florida and other states that experienced our real estate boom in the early part of this decade and throughout the 1990s. During that time, many young couples, and particularly couples experiencing second and third marriages, forewent the pleasure or the experience of an engagement ring at the beginning of their betrothal, and instead took that money and put it into real estate. Later, after the marriage had commenced, did the husband then gave the engagement ring to the spouse. In those cases, it would not be a gift to the wife. It would be considered marital property be, to be divided between the spouses by the court. So what's the lesson here? The lesson here is make sure that you discuss with your lawyer all important assets that you purchased just prior to the marriage and during the marriage and make sure you discuss every important issue with them. If you're going to get divorced, it's an important event in your life. You want the best advice and the best guidance you can get. So please at least consult with a board certified marital and family lawyer.